change the setup of the bike and we put some tents. Uh, so we are at this moment we are closer to to the, to the fastest rider, but not enough uh, that we would like. What, what did you change at all? What, what did you to get better? Uh, we were in a too much soft suspension and we put more hard and more standard. Like uh, last year, uh, and in this track it works. In Sepan it doesn't work, in Malaysia, but in this track uh, it was better. How important is it to have these pre race tests for people that don't know about this? How important is this to you guys? Ah, it's very important. It's very important to, to compare and understand uh, this tricky track because it's very complicated to do. Very long and very complicated to understand. Uh, and with these two days that we are here, uh, I think it's enough to, to have a clearly clear setup of the bike and a clear uh, rider style. What are, when people come here next month to see this, that they've never seen it, what should they expect to see? Uh, for sure, they, they are going to struggle a little bit in the first practice uh, to, to understand the track uh, and to find the, the best setup. No, I mean the fans. What, what should uh, the they fans, expect the to fans. see? How exciting is watching they, they would like They would like MotoGP. Uh, I, think most of, I believe that MotoGP is a great, great show for the people. Uh, it's very funny to, to watch because we have lots of overtakings and, and change of position. I think uh, more than one. Uh, so let's see if they, they like. I think uh, they would like and uh, play this game and give up on the game. Okay, at the uh, at the end of the day yesterday, it seemed like you took out a big chunk of time uh, on the last few laps. Uh, did you put together several things at once, or was there any particular thing that sort of came into you at the end of the day uh, yesterday? We are trying different setups of the bike, not completely, not, nothing new because uh, we don't have new chassis, we don't have new engine. We just can can play with the setup, and that's what we are doing: uh, changing the suspension, changing the, the force, the force. And in the last run, I, I improved half a second of the setup only, and that's why I'm happy. Not. Uh, not enough for me because this this track, especially we are struggling. I think more than than our competitors in that of the corner. We don't have enough grip on the on the rear. That's why we are we cannot lead with confidence. That's why we are uh, farther than uh, than is Have you changed any of your lines yet? Or uh, small small change. Yeah. I love you. To modify a little bit the, the running style to adapt uh, the best line for the track. Any more questions? Kind of, kind of a crazy question. How, how fast are y'all getting those bikes up to? I mean, y'all are flying by me out there. I'm like, how fast are y'all getting those bikes up? To? And what is it like going at those speeds? Yeah, in the main straight we arrive uh, 340 kilometers per hour. It's a, it's a amazing speed. And then when you have to brake and you put your, your helmet up, you feel so, so strong the wind. So it's, it's difficult to, to get stable on this braking with so, so much wind uh, going into your chest and your, your head.